JD Talking Sports. It is Tuesday, February 2nd, 2021. My last show, I said it was December when it was January. And, I, you know, listen, we move on. We grow. We get stronger. We wish everybody happy Groundhog Day. Six more weeks of snow. Gumbo Chef got 24 and a half inches up by him. Thank you, Vizabrina, for going out in the snow and checking it out. I was very impressed by that. New York City, I don't know. Michigan went to work this morning, and the roads were paved. I just had a pounding headache, so I took a nap, and I still have a headache. But I decided that I needed to do a podcast. So I said, you know what? A headache's a headache. We move on from the headache. We go from there. And it's onward and upward to the day. Now... I know I've talked repeatedly about how I'm not a fan of Pete Carroll. And Pete Carroll, to me, blew the Super Bowl, Super Bowl 49, against the Patriots. Well, Cam Chancellor says he still, to this day, can't believe that they did not hand the ball, give the ball to Marshall Lynch. Still, to this day. Doesn't know why. To this day. And we're going into Super Bowl 55. Yes, I agree. I concur. I have to say to him, what the fuck was Pete Carroll thinking? I definitely agree on that front. I say yes, yes, and more yes to that. And, you know, some interesting stuff. I've been reading some interesting stuff. So Matthew Stafford did not want to play for the Pats. And for that, I say good. The Falcons are keeping Julio Jones and Matt Ryan not going anywhere. They haven't had any trade talks, which means they're probably going to be traded. But we'll see how that works out. Matthew Stafford did not want to go to the Pats. Also, the Jets inquired, but I'm glad the Jets didn't take him. I love Matthew Stafford, but I wouldn't give up a trovo draft picks to get him. The Rams, good good going. And a couple other teams were involved. 